As with any craft or skill, crochet requires certain tools to have success. In this video, we will be gathering the two most important tools, yarn and the crochet hook. For this video, I shopped at Walmart and Michaels. First, let's explore crochet hooks. Crochet hooks come in a variety of sizes, the most common being an I or 5.5 millimeter hook. More on this later. And you have many options, such as the cushioned or ergonomic crochet hooks, wooden or aluminum. Aluminum is the most common and often the cheapest. You can buy them in sets or individual. For this series of videos, I'll mainly be using an eye hook. And as I couldn't find one individually, I bought a set that came with a few smaller sizes. These could come in handy later, but at least we have what we need. I did not buy a hook from Michaels as they would have been a little bit more expensive. However, if you have a coupon, which is very common at Michaels, or if you would like a wide selection of the ergonomic hooks, Michaels would be a great place for that. Next is the yarn. We will explore yarn weights later on. But for now, let's look at the label until you find a symbol with a number 4. This notes that this is a medium weight yarn. Sometimes this is called worsted weight and it is the most common for afghans, scarves, and hats. This is the weight that we will be using for our upcoming projects. When at Walmart, I suggest Red Heart Super Saver as it is often the cheapest and they provide the widest color selection. Michaels has their own brand called Impeccable and it is a pretty good brand. It is more expensive than Red Heart but it also has a wide color selection. At Walmart my total came to about $17 with three skeins of yarn and a three hook set. At Michaels, I did not buy a hook, but I did buy four skeins of yarn. And thankfully there was a 30% off sale and my total came to be about $15. And with this, our crochet journey will begin. Thank you for joining me and I will see you next time.